on everyone welcome back to another video over here at piece of the puzzle today we're going to be doing a continuation of our last video the last video is when i introduced you guys to six different boots that you can go ahead and start checking out because we're officially in fall season and so i didn't want you guys to just think that oh i need to go get a chelsea boot or i need to go get you know whatever i want to show you that there's way more to the world of boots and that's what we covered in the last video so today what we're going to do is actually start putting some outfits together with those very same boots from the last video now uh i don't shoot at my home um, I shoot elsewhere because uh, there's more space and all that. The last video I had six boots and I forgot the Chelsea boots. So we've only got five today, but I'm gonna punch in some clips of shooting elsewhere with the Chelsea boot, with the outfit from the Chelsea boot. And it ain't gonna be pretty, but we gotta make it work, right? So. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and put together the outfit so you can just get an idea of how these boots work with what So you can get an idea of what these boots So you can get an idea of what these boots work with and then you know use that as a foundation And then you can start you know applying that to your own wardrobe and building it out building around the boot and then seeing what works for you All right, so um, there's nothing else left to say. Let's go ahead and jump into the first outfit. Okay? All right, so for this first look, I kind of wanted to go with something a bit rugged. Uh, I had just recently gotten these leather suspenders and I've been trying to find ways to incorporate them into my outfits lately. And so I figured, okay, this would be a great opportunity to do so. And so in my opinion, to keep with the whole rugged theme, I'm like, okay, I've got leather suspenders, a denim shirt would look great with these, and I'm already going with boots. So it's kind of a, doing a bit of a play on like the lumberjack-ish woodsman kind of uh, aesthetic, if you will. And so, yeah, denim shirt in blue, brown in the uh, leather suspenders. They do have different shades of brown throughout uh, it is predominantly like a medium to lightish brown but it does have darker tones in it and so that blends in well with the darker to medium brown tones in the boot and then i picked that up in the hat all right so for the second look i'm going with the burgundy boots and I wanted to still keep that kind of rustic theme going on and so that's why I chose this button up shirt that has these kind of Native American patterns going on in it. They've got the maroons, the uh, whites, the grayish tones that really play off well of the boots. And so I stuck with the black pants just for simplicity's sake. The black hat, it has white lettering and designs in it that play off of the white tank top as well as the white in the uh, dress shirt as well as the white in the button up shirt and yeah i think this is a just a very complete outfit uh, i added a little pop of color with the green necklace from lewis elite that brings it all together and yeah i really like this one as well super clean still masculine and rustic at the same time and i think the uh, snapback is a good touch as well All right, so apologies in advance for not being able to see my entire body in this clip. I hadn't realized that the entire body wasn't in frame and that's why I need a monitor. But nonetheless, if you don't know already, I'm smitten over these boots. I wear them all the time and these cargo pants, they're kind of like joggers because they have the elastic band at the foot opening. And so that allows it to go over easier on these boots. Uh, making this a seamless combo uh, went with the brown leather jacket just to tie in with the boots and I wanted to stick with earth tones but add a bit of color to this outfit and so that's why I wanted to go with this mulch to kind of like throw things off in a sense but also stay in tune with it because it adds so much contrast uh, just to top things off I really wanted to just wear a snapback with this and I thought this Detroit hat worked pretty well and overall I'm really happy with how this outfit turned out and it's probably one of my favorites out of all six in this entire video. Alright so we probably got the smartest looking outfit out of the entire bunch. I really wanted to stick with earth tones in this one and I really also wanted to see what I could get away with 
as far as earth tones so what i went ahead and did was i have these chocolate chukka boots the dress ones i went ahead and put them with these chinos because they're kind of like a grayish khaki in color and so i thought that worked really well the trucker jacket it's a completely different shade of khaki or it's khaki compared to the gray of the chinos and it adds a really striking but nice contrast in my opinion and so since we're sticking with earth tones throughout this entire outfit and since it's because it's my only one i went ahead and threw on this forest green turtleneck to really bring home the dapper smart aesthetic to this entire outfit yeah i just i really i really like what i'm seeing here if you can i probably should have even thrown on a chocolate belt and just had that peeking out a bit just to tie in with the boots but the overall color combination with these you know earth tones but strikingly different colors i think worked really well in this outfit all right so for this next outfit we're kind of sticking with the same color palette from the previous one uh with the khakis the greens and the gray i kept on the same gray chinos i put out the uh chocolate chuckas and put on these uh, dark olive suede jodhpur boots i wanted to pick up on that in the t-shirt it's not quite olive gray but the mineral green i think still blends very nicely and so i went ahead and put on the shirt with that the white and the khaki color blocking and then to tie everything in together i went ahead and threw on this khaki uh, cardigan that's a bit richer than the khaki in the shirt but these colors they're all earth tones they still all play really well off of one another and just to really tie things in and add a little pop the uh chains and necklace that i have on this gold and silver i do mix my metals yes and the green and the uh, pendant really just brings even more of that green to the entire outfit and i really think in my opinion it brings everything together this one i'm really pleased with as well i wasn't quite sure how it would turn out but i think i did a damn good job with it so for this last outfit i just wanted to go completely out of the box and throw on this kimono that i think works really well with the hoodie it's a very lightweight hoodie so it's not too hot of an outfit um keep everything else simple with the skinny jeans and the chelsea boots and i throw on the hat because it went with the hoodie uh, i thought it was a nice touch and i'm overall pleased with this outfit so i just wanted to show you six different ways of wearing boots these six different boots you know really allow you to go ahead and start getting creative with your outfits and so if you really enjoyed this video if you liked it as always don't forget to subscribe comment like and share if you really enjoy it and yeah you know follow me on all my platforms they will be linked down below my website my instagram facebook all that good stuff and yeah you know six outfits for the six boots that we went over in the last video and for my just stick with me uh we're gonna have so much more content coming on the way and yeah i hope you find this video helpful and if you put together some outfits or anything like tag me in the videos and you know that'll be a good little thing that we have going on in this community so um as always thank you guys so much for the support and until we put the pieces together again peeps later mm -hmm.